I am uh, suffering a lot just now uh, in my calves, in my legs, in my hips uh, because I just did uh, yesterday, I did another uh, two and a half kilometre run uh, <laughs> which is nothing um, but uh, I'm suffering so much from it just because I've put on so much weight. Um, so the last time I was running, uh, I was up in the Highlands, I was feeling great, I was feeling fit, uh, and it was around about 85, 86 um, kilograms. Um, since then, uh, over the last couple of months, I've put on uh, a hefty amount of weight, and uh, I'm, I'm up to about 12 kilograms uh, heavier than what I was before. And uh, yeah, I haven't done any running for about two months, so there's a little bit of that uh, as well, but... Um, I'm just trying to think, is 12 kilograms really that much of a difference? Um, but then you've got to think about each, like, I woke up in the middle of the night with my calves going into spasm. I'm like, what is going on here? Why is this happening? Um, and uh, you've got to remember how much that actually is over, over a run. So if I do uh, 2,000 meters, two, uh, two and a half thousand meters, that was the distance I ran yesterday. Now my stride length, which my watch tells me, is uh, about 80 centimeters. Uh, so if I times that by 1.2, that will give me, my. I did about 3,000 steps in a 20, <laughs> 20 minute run. Pretty rubbish. Uh, very rubbish compared to what I was able to do. <clears throat> now, we think about the added weight, so I have increased by, let's say, say I call that 12 kilograms, <clears throat> sorry, that's 36,000 kilograms, you've got to think. But then you've got to think about when you're, uh, for me, I am a four foot striker because I do some barefoot running. Um, and uh, I've got that technique down, so I'm four foot striking. So that's only using the front half of my foot. So we could times that uh, by two, because that's definitely what my calf is having to deal with over a 20 minute run. However, you've also got to remember that when running or jogging, when you're actually impacting the ground, you're impacting the ground with uh, more force than what you are. So 12 kilograms is when you're just standing. When you're pounding the ground, especially if you're going uphill, or especially if you're going downhill, you are uh, hitting the ground with more force. And that can be around about four times. Hold on. Times that by four. I think I know why my calves are spasming in the middle of the night just now. It's because in just a 20 minute jog, just because I've increased my body weight by 12 kilograms over the last two months, in 20 minutes, in, in a two and a half kilometre jog, I am having to do an extra 288,000 kilograms of force going through each of my calves. That's a lot in such a short period of time. That in, in, I think maybe that's also the fact that it's in, that's in just like 20 minutes. An extra 288,000 kilograms kilograms of force through each calf. So yeah, that, I think I kind of understand why my ankles, my knees, and my hips are really feeling a bit tender there. So yeah, if you're thinking of getting into running, if you've put on weight, just be prepared. Take it, just build up the walking first, because it is, it is tough on your body if you haven't been training a lot.